Welcome back. We have a new addition to the News 3 Now family. Chris Stanford will be joining our weekday morning show on the Anchor Desk with Leah Linscheid and Josh Spryder. Chris is in the newsroom. Hi, Chris. Sorry we can't have you on the interview <laughs> set out here. It's not a very nice way to introduce yeah, somebody. Yeah, not very polite, but, but you know, welcome. Welcome. Welcome aboard and welcome back to Wisconsin. You are a Wisconsin kid. I know. It's a homecoming of sorts. I've been looking forward to this for a long time and uh, I could not be happier uh, to be back in Wisconsin and to have my family. Uh, I got little kids, so uh, I'm excited for them to grow up in Wisconsin just like I did. Tell us about your family. Uh, I think we have a picture. Here we are. Oh, that's a great picture. And that's right. Those are three girls. I know uh, everybody out there is like, oh man, you're in for it. You know, <laughs> wait until they get older, right? Three weddings, Dad. Yes. Three weddings yes, to so pay I for. Have a one, three, and a five year old. And that is my lovely, beautiful, smart, and talented wife, Amy, there. Uh, she's also from Wisconsin. We both grew up in the Stevens Point area. We both went to UWSP and uh, we're excited to be close to family and friends who we have been away from for a few years while uh, my career got going and hers as well. So it's it's a really exciting time in the Stanford household right now. Well, we're so happy to have you, and we're looking forward to meeting all of them. You are coming to us most recently from Oklahoma City. Mm -hmm. uh, tell us a little bit about the trajectory of your career. Um, well, I've worked at stations in Wisconsin. I've, I've worked in uh, Minneapolis, uh, St. Louis, uh, for a stint in Wichita. I, I've bounced around a lot, it may sound like, but um, Wisconsin is, is definitely home for us. And I, I've really put a focus on my career recently into um, getting more involved in the community. And that's what I'm excited about doing, uh, starting here in Madison, is, is I want to get connected and I want to be a part of the community and give back on top of telling important, relevant, and uh, compelling stories that make a difference. Yeah, that is important. You don't mind getting up at 2 in the morning? Uh, no, not at all. It's funny, you know, it sounds kind of crazy, but it actually works out really well when you have little kids. You know, you get done early and you're able to spend a lot of time with them. I love being able to pick my girls up from school, uh, being there for dinner and being there uh, for bedtime as well. Yeah, and you've, you're doing that in Oklahoma City right now, mm -hmm. right? You're on the mornings right now. What else can you tell us about you personally, just so our viewers can get to know you a little bit? Like, what kinds of things do you like to do outside of work? What are your hobbies? What are you looking forward to about being back in Wisconsin? Oh, it's so much. Um, I can't wait to get back out on the golf course again. Uh, I love a good DIY project. My <laughs> wife and I do a lot of home renovations, uh, so I'm not scared to get my hands dirty. You know, I really look at myself as just an, an average down-to-earth guy who is uh, relatable. And I hope that when viewers tune in on Wednesday, that they'll see the same, that what you see is, is what you get. All right, we'll see you Wednesday morning, bright and early, 4.30. Chris, again, welcome to News 3 Now. You're, you're so joining much, a Mark great team. We are so happy to have you. Best of luck, and we'll be watching Wednesday morning. I appreciate it.